If we're going to hit a one-handed backhand, and Amy, you're going to try this. Uh, both of you change the grip. We'll both try it in swinging right now. Turn by stepping with your left foot. Take that racket back. Make sure the grip is changed. Now we adjust our feet. And Amy, now very lightly, Stephen, with the left hand. Let the left hand guide the racket out toward the ball. Instead of hitting the ball more opposite our belly or hip, on the one-handed backhand, we're going to hit a little bit sooner. Notice how my racket face is beveled as it was in the forehand, pretty much perpendicular to the anticipated flight of the ball. I lift that ball out to where I want it to go, and slowly, the very tip end of my racket comes around the ball, naturally and slowly, all the way around. My finish is like my forehand of my feet, tip of the toe, weight to my front foot. I may not open my hips quite as far. It's not so important because I don't have to clear that hip out of the way to finish my swing, you see. I may not turn quite so far forward, but my wrist is eye level and the racket is nice and high. It's not in here, it's I keep the angle that I have here. The racket finishes well above the wrist.